This is code.org. Let's talk binary. So, how many bits would you need to count all the students in your class? Now, I'd say there's a bit of a trap in this question, and it's the third word. How many bits? When they're saying bits, they mean digits. A bit is either a zero or a one. Bytes, which we talked about briefly, are eight bits, right? Eight digits long. So when you're thinking bits, if your class has one person in it, well, that would be one bit, because one could represent that. Okay, so bits is how many digits? All right, let's now, well, remember, binary, we only have two options, zero and one. Zero, shockingly represents zero. That's kind of a zero. One represents one. Now what? Well, now we're out of digits. We only have zeros and ones. So if I want to go up to the number two, well, I have to add to the end of it. Think of this almost as a nine. When you're at a nine, you're out of digits. So when I'm at a nine, what do I do? Well, I say, okay, one, zero. So that would represent two. Now what? Well, I have a zero here. I can still change that to a one. So now 11 is three. Whoa, the highest number I can go to is a one. So once again, I am out of digits. Think of it like 99. So what do I do? One, zero, zero would be a four. So on and so forth. So when thinking about how many people are in your class, you want to keep in mind how this numbering system works. Now, hopefully you still have your flippy do handy because if you do, you can pretty rapidly get a rough estimate of the number of digits required, right? So maybe you have 16 kids in your class, one, these would all be zeros then, but how many digits would that be? Well, one, two, three, four, five, so on and so forth. So if you have this handy, that would be a big help. All right. So like I was saying, um, obviously, this is my answer, not yours. Plagiarism serious. And don't get caught. This is really easy to find. So binary has two numbers. Uh, not numbers. Has two symbols, zero and one to count by. It is a two, it is a base two number system. And then I would say something about my class. So my class has, uh, let's say my class has four students. That means it would take three digits, right? Or think of digits, bits is really what they're saying there, because a bit is zero, one, a byte is eight. So it would take three bits to count all of them. And I would go ahead and put the number. My class of four would be one, zero, zero, one, and binary. Boom. Now that's my answer and not yours. Make sure you are writing about your class and your number of students. Cool. Onward.